Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Chamberlain coffee. This is the cold brew. They're all lattes. So this is cold brew. This is vanilla. A mocha and cinnamon roll. These were two ninety eight. Cinnamon bun. Cinnamon bun. These were two ninety eight at Walmart. Two ninety eight each at Walmart, and they were in like where the Starbucks cans and the Dunkin' can uh, bottles and stuff like that were in Walmart. Um, it says cold brew latte, plant based with almond and coconut milk. This is a twelve ounce can for two ninety eight. It says, great coffee on the go. Uncomplicated and delicious, inspired by my very own recipe, Love Emma. Um, shake well, serve cold, 70 milligrams of caffeine. These are manufactured for Chamberlain Coffee in Los Angeles, California, chamberlaincoffee.com. Uh, we've never heard of Chamberlain Coffee. Not around here, at least. No. Uh, so, one can is 110 calories. And these have been in the refrigerator, so they're very cold. And we have... And we shook them. Shaken them, yes, before we They've been shook -a shook -a They're shook -a as Ashley would say. shook -a It's like chocolate. Okay, you take the first drink. That looks very strong. It does. It's just cold brew latte with almond and coconut milk. 70 milligrams of caffeine. It's not it's bitter. It's very bitter. Um, it's not as bad as we some we've had that was like straight up no cream or no sugar, no anything. That's okay. I get that coconut flavor in there too. Um, there's a gosh, it uh, it, it's pretty much a straight up coffee. It needs some sugar. Yeah, bad, 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 bad. Needs some sugar. It looks like chocolate um, milk, not chocolate milk. It um, that is very, very strong um it doesn't taste like pure black coffee right no it's been creamered for yes sure. it does have yes it's like they put creamer in it but no sweetness or, at all or very very little um i could not drink that i couldn't either i would sure have it. to um i think i'd have to get paid to drink the whole can <laughs> and um I, I think i would get sick I literally think it would make me sick if I drank it all it's because strong. it's that strong. Yeah. It just, um, there's a whole funkiness. Let's go on to the next one so I can get that out. It's that there's a whole funkiness that it's almost nauseating to me that I do not like that. Uh, this is the vanilla latte. Same thing, almond and coconut milk. This one's 120 calories. So it is 10 additional calories. I think if you like like black coffee, which is a little creamer, I think you would like that because you're used to drinking that darker, bitter flavor. Yeah, but um, go ahead. it's not for me. It's the uh, same caffeine content. I'm hoping this one will have a better flavor. Please. It does not. It actually tastes almost exactly the same. Well, <laughs> but you do taste the vanilla, but. You do get a little bit of the vanilla, not a whole lot, but a little bit. Do you ever remember, or did your mom ever tell you, my mom told me, you know, you think as a kid that when you first start baking and you smell the vanilla in the cabinet, you think, gosh, this would be terrific to drink on its own. And then your mom tells you, no, Tammy, don't do that because it doesn't taste the same on its own. It tastes terrible on its own. This is like <laughs> raw vanilla. Raw Yes, with that with that coffee flavor. I don't think it tastes that much different than this one. I do. I really. It's a it's a very very strong oh, yeah, vanilla, um, but it's not good. It, no, it's I, still not sweet. I don't like it at all. If you had sweetener packets and put it in there, it may be slightly better. I don't. Uh, mm, 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 no, I'm not drinking it no matter what. Uh, this one is the mocha. Um, this is 120 calories, same caffeine. But these are not made, just in case someone's wondering, um, and thinking, oh, you can just add sweetener. They're not really made for sweetener because you drink them out of the can. Well, it doesn't give instructions for that. No, I'm you saying know, most uh, of the time you're going to drink them out of the can. You're not yes. pouring them into a glass. Most no. of them are drinking these straight out of the can. Yeah, you, yeah, you, uh, they do, this does say dairy free. Um, yeah, this isn't meant for you to add anything to this can sweetener creamer and it doesn't say that anyway uh it says great coffee on the go yeah. it's supposed to be ready to go uh so mocha i don't even want to drink it <laughs> it's no better than the other ones. 
It does get a little bit of chocolate flavor. It's a nutty flavor. Uh, I can see that. Kind of like a to me, it's kind of cocoa kind of powder. Kind of, yeah, it's kind of cocoa and nutty. But I tell you what, I, I it this the mocha tastes better to me than the first two. Um, I because think I like it the does have flavor. a little bit of a nutty flavor to it. It's not the um, because the nutty flavor is so high, then it kind of tamp down that that heavy coffee flavor Not a little much, bit and so to me so far this is the best one so i would drink the vanilla over that. oh no way that vanilla is so strong um now i'm kind of scared about this one only because it's cinnamon bun um it's 110 calories um, only because i posted a picture on Instagram when I found these in Walmart. And when I did, I had several people say, don't buy the cinnamon bun. <laughs> and I thought, scary. <laughs> yeah, I thought too late, too late. I already bought it. Um, they said that it was very, very, very strong. But I'm wondering, is this the only one they bought? They might not have bought all the other ones to compare it to either. You know, not everybody does a review. It, most people would just pick up one oh, can. See if it liked it. Oh my gosh. It's like raw. It's raw, raw powder and cinnamon. Oh, it's raw cinnamon. And what's funny, the underlying flavor under all of these, no matter what the flavoring is, is still a very raw, bitter, strong coffee. Um, and then they, you add on a strong, sharp bitter cinnamon yeah it's not very i strong. would never trust this company or person or or whoever love emma with uh-uh no not when it comes to coffee no you know what though like i said this has its specific audience for somebody that oh, likes a really gosh. dark dark coffee because i can't imagine sitting and drinking black coffee but i know people i work with people that ne they pour it straight out of the pot and drink it i mean that's but how can you put Raw, literally raw it's cinnamon raw in cinnamon. something, and think huh, that tastes great. How can I, 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 it, like I said, it's not for me. Some people might love this. It's well, I think they're me. horrible. I mean, I you can I expect to see these at the end of the uh, yeah. at least one of them. Uh, which one see, am I going to choose? The cinnamon one. That's the worst one. Yeah, for the great. end of the month. Um, yeah. The we've had other coffees like this that were nice and creamered and sweetened and they mm -hmm. had a good flavor to them so it's not like we don't like flavor of the oh, we canned love or coffee. prepared people, coffee i think people well if you're new to the channel you wouldn't know yeah i'm that. just saying we we've had other coffees that we've liked fine oh, it's yeah. just these are very the underlying flavor is very very strong and bitter and um it's just overall it's just not a perfect experience out of the can for us it may be for you but it's not for us no, not at all. Um, not at all. I don't know how. I, 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 everybody's taste is different. Everybody's taste is different. I hate them. I hate all <laughs> I of them. Not. I wouldn't recommend any of them. I think um, we, if you wa like, we wasted, tw this is $12. Yeah. Gone. If, the, only, the only person that would try this is somebody that likes black coffee. You can try them out. You may like them. If you don't like pure black coffee, don't get these. No, don't. So, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.